Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. My name is Shanti. I'm so excited that you clicked on today's video. If you're looking for some motivation, I got it covered. We're cleaning, we're organizing, doing some decorating for Valentine's Day, and I even share a yummy chocolate chip recipe. So before we jump into baking the chocolate chip cookies, I just wanted to kind of show you guys what we're working with as far as Valentine's decor goes. So we're going to be decorating, but that's going to be at the end. We have some organizing to do as well. I have these clear acrylic bins and, and I also need to organize two of my utensil drawers so I have some like drawer dividers and things back there. All right, and I'm super excited to be baking these cookies today, you guys, because this is my first time I'll be using my KitchenAid mixer. Anyhow, the first thing you want to do is preheat your oven to 375 degrees. I will have the ingredients listed down below in the description box, but all you need is one cup of butter flavored Crisco, one cup of sugar, one cup of brown sugar firmly packed, three eggs, one teaspoon vanilla extract, one teaspoon baking soda, one teaspoon salt, three cups of flour, and then two cups of semi-sweet chocolate chips. Just in case you've never used the butter flavor Crisco, this is what it looks like. I got this from Walmart, and all you need is one of these for this recipe, unless you wanna double it up. Of course, then you need two, but go ahead and screenshot that. So the very first thing we're gonna do is mix together is the Crisco, the sugar, and then the brown sugar. We'll mix that together and then we'll add in the vanilla extract, eggs, salt, and baking soda, and then we'll slowly add in the flour. So I just want to give you guys a quick little tip. I have my baking soda stored here in this OXO container for two reasons. You guys, I you know how you open the box of the baking soda? Well, the ones I use comes in the box. Anyways, so you open it up and then I'll just stick it like in a Ziploc bag and then it kind of just makes a mess. So what I've done is, like I said, I've stored it in the OXO container and then at the bottom, I just put the expiration date with the dry erase marker. So therefore, every time I replace it, I can also wipe off the expiration date and then reapply it. I'm in love with this measuring set, you guys, the black and wood. I got it from Amazon. If you follow me over my vlogging channel, then you've already seen this, but I just wanted to show it. Super cute to me. Even though it hurts, I won't show it to you. Cause it will ricochet, I won't let it bite. I will look at you and tell you that I'm all right. Like a ricochet, it will come back to you. I don't care about you anymore So you can't hurt me like you did before Let me tell you Not because my eyes are open Your words will keep bouncing away And even if you try to hurt me My skin's getting thicker each day Alright, so now we can go ahead and fold in the chocolate chips. Also, if you wanted to add like walnuts or whatever, you can go ahead and do that at this time. I'm just making these strictly strictly chocolate chip cookies. Oh, let me 
Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and cover the bowl and we'll refrigerate it for about 20 to 30 minutes or however long it takes us to kind of tidy up the refrigerator. I'm going to go ahead and put this in our garage refrigerator because right now I'm going to go ahead and wipe out the refrigerator here in the house. Okay, so the refrigerator is not super bad. Like, I don't think there's any spills or anything, but it definitely needs to be reorganized, especially this drawer. Look at this drawer, you guys. I just... I don't know it definitely just needs to be organized like I have different cheeses opened and lunch meat so we're definitely gonna be organizing this drawer this is my main focus for those of you that haven't been following me long this drawer right here has been designated for years now for our leftover drawer and it's worked really well now I don't need to do anything to this bin because I just cleaned it out last night so it's already wiped out and all of the leftovers are just in there so basically like I said it just needs to be reorganized so here are the acrylic bins I'm going to be using to organize that drawer I just showed you guys in the refrigerator. So I just want to say thank you to LifeWit for sponsoring today's video. They sent me this 25 piece organizing set. Now I'm not going to clearly use them all in the refrigerator today, but I love the fact that I can use these all around the house. You can use these in the bathroom, in your office, in your desk, so many different functions. They also sent me some storage cubes and storage bags. I'll show you guys that in a second. So this is what the storage bags look like. It comes through to a pack. As you can see here, I've only utilized one so far, but this actually came at a perfect time because I had my Christmas bedding just sitting in a trash bag. And honestly, that's typically how I store my bedding and my throw pillows and I'm, I'm just so happy I received this because as you can see, these are fairly large. This held a comforter, a throw blanket and two throw pillows. So I'm absolutely in love. I love how they have a clear window so you can see directly inside. You don't have to guess what's inside these storage bags. They have reinforced handles and they're made of premium material. LifeWood also sent these 11 inch storage cubes. They come six to a pack. I absolutely love storage cubes because I feel like you can use them for just multi-purpose uses that help keep you organized. I love how it has a practical design. They also fit an array of different decor styles. These bins come in a few different colors. If you're like me and you're in the process of organizing and decluttering your home, I will have LifeWit's link down below in the description box. Thanks again to LifeWit for sponsoring today's video. Inside your bedroom, we stopped counting the days lost in the rhythm. Physical silence, no need to speak a word. Lay here beside me. The one I love to first, your lips on the floors, sipping on your love, sipping on your love. So as you can see, this definitely needs to be wiped out. Once I wipe it out, I'm going to use the acrylic bins and I'll like start positioning them so I can see how I'm going to utilize them. And then I'll take them out and wash them before I actually use them. Today is your first time clicking on one of my videos. In each one of my videos, I try to either recite a motivational quote or statement, and I also try to make them relevant. So something that has either happened in my life recently or just something I feel that was heavy on my heart. This week's motivational quote is, we won't be distracted by comparison 
if we were captivated by purpose. And I'm going to tell you guys something. I don't like comparison. I do not like it. I'm with Theodore Roosevelt. He said, comparison is the thief of joy. And it absolutely is. There's no need to compare yourself. And if we were all focused on our own individual purpose, we wouldn't even have time for that, right? So now that the containers have been washed and dried, I'm gonna go ahead and start organizing the cheese and the lunch meat in the containers. I don't know why I didn't do this sooner, but this makes so much more sense. You guys should see me when I'm in here trying to find like unsalted butter and salted butter. So what I did was separate them by the container. So this container has salted butter. The one back there to the right has unsalted butter. And then this one is flavor butter. All the cheeses are back there. I put sliced cheese in one, shredded cheese in one, and then cheese sticks in one. And then right here, as you can see, I have the lunch meat, turkey bacon, and sausage. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna reorganize this stuff right here. I'm not gonna be taking it out. I'm just gonna be positioning things where they belong. But I do need to soak these strawberries and then cut those up. So I'll probably do that. I'll just go ahead and soak the strawberries in water and vinegar while I'm organizing the rest of the refrigerator. I'm a mess. I'm not my best. But I won't stop until you curiosity how many of you actually like cleaning your refrigerator I feel like that's the one chore um, other than laundry that I hear people say that they do not like and I have to agree I don't care for cleaning the refrigerator it's clearly something that needs to be done I love the end result but I don't actually like cleaning the refrigerator I just want to let you know that I'll do anything to get you here Oh, I could never let you go. I'll make it worth your while if you appear. If I change my ways, babe, won't you come back to me? Make no mistakes, babe, won't you come back to me?
Okay, y'all, so you know we gotta talk shows every video, I don't care. I'm not sure if I mentioned in the last video that my husband and I are currently watching a show called In the Dark. I know I mentioned it on my vlogging channel, but that's on Netflix, that's a really good show. Let me know down below if you have seen it. If you haven't, I highly recommend it. Once again, In the Dark on Netflix. Also, my friend Yesenia, her channel is actually Simply Yesenia, but she told me about a show called The Gilded Age. I love that. It's on Hulu. It's basically like a side show, something I don't watch with my husband, so I don't feel like I'm cheating on him. So <laughs> let me know if you guys do that. If you have shows that you watch with your spouses and then shows that you watch by yourself. Also, how many of you guys have to cut up your fruit? Because otherwise, if you don't, it will go to waste. That's exactly how it goes down in my house. Everything has to be cut up or goes to waste. I give you my tomorrow forever now. Spotlight from my cell phone Sounds like it's your ringtone I get chills when you call Wanna give you my heart So I might talk all night long Show me affection, attention, and care Losing attention I just wanted to say thank you so much to each and every one of you. We have reached 25,000 subscribers, AKA 25,000 beauties, and I couldn't be more happy. Thank you guys so much. We talk and my head's getting nervous I can't handle this on and off I can't know I just gotta know where you are If I want to remain sane But you're close and every text and call Oh no You could be running off with somebody else All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and put this in the oven for about eight to nine minutes. And as you guys seen, I was adding chocolate chips to the top. That way, when it bakes, you can actually see the chocolate chips on top. Tell me where your heart is these days. Are you being honest with me? I don't wanna go this cray cray, but I think I'm- So while the cookies are in the oven, I wanna try to tackle this. I've already removed the old organizer and put in the new one. I had to be sure that it fit. But y'all, look at all this silverware. This is crazy. We don't even really use this silverware anymore. That's from when Khaleesi and Junior were smaller. There's only a couple spoons and forks that they still use, but they're regular size, but I know I can get rid of all that. And I just wanna be able to organize this better. This is, this is crazy. Also, this one has six compartments. Well, technically it has seven, but I was only able to utilize six of the compartments in my drawer. So see, it does pull out to another compartment, but I couldn't do that. That's why I love these kind of organizers because they adjust to your drawer size. Nevertheless, I was only able to utilize six compartments. With this one, I have eight. So yeah, I'm really excited to see how it comes out. So let's get busy decluttering. Tell me what's the hold up, baby. Tell me why your phone's off lately. I don't wanna go all crazy, but I think I'm losing it. Tell me where your heart is these days. Are you being honest with me? I don't wanna go this cray cray, but I think I'm losing it. But I think I'm losing it. I think I'm losing it. I think I'm losing it. But. I think I'm losing it, I think I'm losing it, I think I'm losing it, but Wish my mind and I could 
could free ourselves from agony but without you here it's hard. wow you guys so i'm getting rid of all of this this is crazy first of all look at this knife so all of the rubber has come off of this knife Look at this one. I've had these for a very long time. These straws are toe up. And like I said, all of this silverware, the kids do not use it. I'm going to be tossing this and I'll donate this silverware because there's absolutely nothing wrong with it. But everything else that looks beat up, I will not be donating because I don't donate junk. But yeah, that's the end result. I'm so happy with how this looks. Y'all, look at this. I could close the drawer and open it. <laughs> It's crazy. It's the simple things, you guys. But that didn't take long at all to do, and the result is amazing. Oh my gosh, look at this drawer. All right, so before we do this drawer, you guys, I am going to put the cookies on the cooling rack. Sure you had fun tonight. You and me felt all right. But it's time, but it's time you pick up your phone. Mm -hmm. You won't be worth my while. Me and you won't work out. Pick it up, pack it up, get a cab and go. It's not your phone, my baby. It's not on you, my baby I'm just not the right kind of girl for you You deserve somebody who's loving you You shouldn't call me later so this recipe makes either four dozen cookies or very close to four dozen so I just went ahead and put another batch in the oven so that would give me two dozen cookies and I'm gonna freeze the rest Now you guys know all that stuff shouldn't have been in this drawer. That's crazy. But now I'm gonna take this Pioneer Woman liner out and I'm gonna put this black liner in. It's not your phone, my baby. It's not on you, my baby. I'm just not the right kind of girl for you. You deserve somebody who's loving you. You shouldn't call me later. Promise it's for the better. I'm just not the right kind of girl for you. Cause I got a rule. I hold on to my heart Share with nobody I don't want nobody else Yeah, I hold on to my heart Give it up for nobody I just keep it to myself I've been to her before I've been to hell before So I hold on to my Okay, so now we're gonna go ahead and start to declutter and I'm gonna be using these drawer dividers to help keep me organized.
here's everything that I do not want. And then these items here, I'm gonna see if my mom wants. And if she doesn't want them, I'll just go ahead and donate them. And this is the after. make all my utensils look cohesive I want them to be all black and like wood textured and these dividers are wood I absolutely love them all right guys so now I'm going to attempt to decorate this tear tray now this is a fairly large tear tray I don't have a ton of decor I usually have a, a little bit more uh, I eliminated the Ray Dunn this year so that's why I don't have as much so let's see if we can make this look full Let me know down below how many of you actually decorate for Valentine's Day. I feel like quite a few people that I know that typically decorate for Valentine's Day, they ain't doing it this year. They, they're not feeling it. Nobody's really feeling it. I'm gonna be honest, I really wasn't feeling it. But I went ahead and did it because I love to decorate. So any excuse. Now, I'm happy I did it because I love how it came out. And it's just like subtle touches. But anyways, like I said, I'm just curious to know how many of you actually decorate, if you typically decorate, or if you're just not going to do it this year. I said the last drink was the last drink. You make it hard to leave. We're telling secrets in the dark while drinking whiskey need. I would fall in a second if you let me, cause you're all that I want. do this but like closer to the end of the video I don't know why it falls like that but if this is your first time clicking on one of my videos I just wanted to say thank you thank you for hanging out and clicking on the video but I just want to take a minute to introduce myself like I said in the beginning my name is Shanti I'm a wife and I'm a mother of three and if you'd like to get to know me and my family a little bit more personally we do have a vlogging channel it is always linked down below in the description box on another note you guys uh, this is probably going to like upset some of you guys. I'm kind of growing out of Ray Dunn. Not kind of, I am. I don't really, I don't like Ray Dunn anymore that much. I love it in other people's homes. I still think it's very nice. But recently I have gotten rid of the canisters. If you guys want to see what the new ones look like, like I said, head over to my vlogging channel. I kind of feel like my style of decor is evolving. I don't want to say I'm shying away from farmhouse because I'm not. I've always had a modern farmhouse uh, like style of decor but I feel like it's just becoming a little bit more modern than farmhouse if that makes sense also I'm not sure if I'll get rid of like all my Ray Dunn because I have a lot I may keep some seasonal items I don't know I just haven't made it in my mind it's just not something I want to see around my house on a daily basis So 
in that basket, I'm putting hand soap, dish soap, and a multi-purpose spray. The brand is called Everspring. I get it from Target, and that's in the scent Lemon Mint. I believe it's Lemon Mint. But you guys, it smells super good. If you haven't tried it, I highly recommend it. So I'm about to give you an overview of what the decor looks like the very next day while the kitchen is nice and bright. I don't like to talk during that time because this is my favorite part of the video where you get to look at the decor and listen to the music. It's kind of like, you know, an ambiance. But anyways, I'm going to end the video right here. If you guys like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please be sure to do so. Make sure you hit that notification bell. I will see you guys in the next video. Do not forget to head down to the description box and check out that LifeWit link. You got